Ephesians 4 and 14, then we will no longer be immature. Yeah, you don't want to be immature, man. When you come to this truth, okay, you got to be immature. Okay, you got to grow uh, via the milk, the basics of the scriptures, go ahead. No longer be immature like children. We won't be tossed and blown about by every wind of new teaching. Yeah, new teachings, man, like saying that Yahweh loves everybody, and that's not true. Go ahead, bro. Yeah, mermaids. Yeah, mermaids. Um, a flat earth. Yeah, flat earth. All these different uh, doctrines are all false philosophies. Those are all taught to throw to throw off people, okay? But the elect is not going to be thrown off. No enchantment on Jake, right? Yep. Ephesians 4 and 14. We will not be influenced when people try to trick us. Yeah, and that's what's going on in the nation of Israel. They're trying to uh, trick, you know, the younger brothers, saying that, you know, the, the, the book of uh, Hebrews is not part of the Holy Scriptures. Yep. Uh, trying to uh, go against Apostle Paul and saying that uh, Luke, Luke is not, uh, how you say that word? It's not. Uh, oh yeah, Luke. Uh, Luke is just, Luke and Mark are just a man because yep. they didn't walk with Yahweh Shai. Yep. Okay, because they wrote the testimony. They were there. Okay. Um, you know they had scribes that wrote for them. Baruch wrote for Jeremiah. Yep. Right. Okay, and different scribes. Timothy, mm -hmm. right, wrote for uh, you know different different uh, um, apostles. Okay, so just because he wasn't there, you're mocking the men of the Lord. That's just like you know. So and then again, um, going back to trickery, that goes back to uh, Esau Edom. Yep. Okay, because he was known as what? That cunning hunter. Okay, we will not be, and what is he hunting? He's hunting down the, the Hebrew Israelites, the so-called Negroes, so-called Latinos, so-called Native Americans. Okay, that's who he's trying to actually get. Those are the ones that he hates, and he especially hates the ones that have the true doctrine. That's why you're always going to have people bugging up against the true doctrine, just like the time of Yahweh Shai, just like the time of the disciples, and just like right now. Okay, we will not be influenced when people try to trick us with yeah. lies so clever they sound like the truth okay yeah, lies so clever that they sound like the truth man again going back to those bug outs i believe they're a uh, canet of israel something like that Arch? Israel? yeah these are uh, be part of the philly camp yeah yeah and that, that's bugged out man and that's actually prophecy when you go into the book of matthew the uh, 24 chapter and many false prophets will arise in these last days to, to deceive many i think it's, it's a karat israel, israel or something like that yeah, 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 yeah. Like, we were talking about a different brother in the group chat like yeah, because there's a lot of bug outs that are going around with false doctrine, but there's only one that stays true to the doctrine. Okay, that's starting with the, the apostles and the elders at GMS and the men that have that like mind doctrine. That goes in the 1 Corinthians 1 and 10, that we all speak the same thing. And if someone doesn't speak the same thing, then they have to get rebuked. That's why you see rebuke videos going out. Okay? Second Peter 2 and 1. But there were false prophets also among the people, even as there shall be false teachers among you who privily shall bring in damnable heresies, even denying the Lord Yahweh that, that bought them and bring upon themselves swift, swift destruction. Yeah, and you that know? reminds me of, uh, I think that's in the book of uh, Second Kings where the Lord said, and I will be I will be a spirit unto him and give him a, a false speeches. You know, speaking about false prophecies, man. So these are bug outs that are teaching uh, contrary to Yahweh Bashem al man. They're doing it for their, their own destruction, yeah. their own demise. And yeah. ultimately, it was it was it was ordained. They were ordained to to go off. They were ordained to to do this, man. This is all prophecy being fulfilled. Yeah. And yeah. ultimately, they want to stand out. They want to stand out from a crowd. When we're supposed to humble ourselves, only the meek and lowly shall inherit the earth. Okay, so we're supposed to be meek and lowly under Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai, that's what we boasted. That we don't boast in our own works, even if we we do a video. Okay, um, we're supposed to be going on to the next video because again, Micah seven and nine. We're bearing the sin of our indignation, you know, which is righteous anger from the Heavenly Father. We got to bear that cross. We still don't know if we're going to be able to make it. Okay, when you got, when you got, um, you know, um, apostles like Apostle Tahar, Apostle Tahar been in this for what, 38 years? Yeah. Okay, 37 years. So, and he's still grinding. He's still putting out work. So that just shows that he fears Yahweh by Shemir Shai. And we are at the same, we should be on the same matter. If we're in the same accord, we should uh, fear Yahweh by Shemir 